How to Use Agora Pulse Beginner Tutorial 2023 Hello and welcome! In today's tutorial, we're going to walk you through the basics of Agora Pulse, an all-in-one social media management tool that can help you streamline your social media marketing efforts. Whether you're a marketer, a social media manager, or just getting started with social media, Agora Pulse is a powerful tool that can help you manage your social media accounts, engage with your audience, and measure your success. In this tutorial, we'll cover everything you need to know to get started with Agora Pulse, from setting up your account to scheduling posts and monitoring your social media performance. We'll show you how to use Agora Pulse's powerful features to manage your social media presence and grow your following. So whether you're looking to improve your social media marketing, boost engagement, or grow your business, this tutorial is for you. So let's dive right in and learn how to use Agora Pulse to take your social media marketing to the next level. Now the first thing you're going to do is of course, go to agorapulse.com. Now this is the home page of Agora and you would be able to read different information about this website if you would like to know more information. As you can see, it is everything you need to dominate social media, fortified with the industry's number one customer support service. Now let's get started. The first thing you're going to do is of course try it for free by clicking this button over here. Now by clicking that, we would be redirected to the sign up page where we will need to enter our business email, confirm our email by retyping it, and then password over here. Now after signing up, we would need to enter our first name, last name, our primary goal over here, and how we would like to describe our role. For now, we're going to enter our first name, the last name over here, our primary goal is to monitor social media. You could choose any of this option. You have manage conversations, report on social media performance, publish or schedule content. And how would I describe my role or how you would describe your role? You could add, I manage social for my organization. I manage a team that manage your social or I do both over here. We're going to go with the first option. Click on next. How many social profiles do you engage? You can choose from 1 to 40 plus over here. How many people are handling your social media in your company? You can choose from 1 to 8. We're going to go with 1 for now. We're just going to have random information for this. But if you are trying to create your account, make sure that you are using accurate information. Which plan best describe your needs? Standard, basic publishing, monitoring, reporting at affordable price, professional, collaborate with your team and create content approval workflows advanced create and share advanced reports manage at a high volume of posts and incoming messages over here or not sure yet if you don't know what you would like to do now over here is your company already using a social media tool let's say no for now and do you have any access to google analytic account let's say no for the meantime click on next and over here what is the name of our organization we're going to go with of your world for the meantime then what is the website of your organization right now we don't have any so we're going to put in a random website just like that how many people work only me two to ten or one thousand plus employees over here you're going to choose how many you are what category best describe your business we can have marketing e-commerce government multi-locational offline single location offline business and other over here for now, we're going to go with marketing, social media agency, or whatever option that you would like to have here. We're going to enter your, your number over here. We're going to choose your code and then enter your phone number in this section. And over here, how did you hear about us? We're going to say maybe YouTube. Just like that, you could use any other options that you have. This is mainly for developing their community. And now after entering this information, you're going to have to add your profiles like your Facebook page, Facebook group, Instagram business profile, Twitter, LinkedIn, LinkedIn company page, YouTube, Google business profile, or TikTok over here. We're going to go with this version for now. And as you can see here, I have a page in Facebook. This is just a random page and I'm going to add this into our ad group also over here. I'm going to click on I'm done adding Facebook pages just like that. And, and now let's begin using ad group pulse. And now as you can see here, our account is now done setting up. That's going to ask us what we would like to do first. We could either schedule content, check inboxes, or get my reports. 
we could start with any of this but for now we're going to click on skip and start exploring so that we would be able to explore what we could do with agropulse now over here the first thing we are seeing is schedule a post our inbox is loading as well over here on the left side we have publishing composer inbox listening publish calendar fans and followers reports social media roi and library over here we're going to click on our publishing composer over here we're going to click this and over here this is where we will be able to create post on our facebook page or whatever page you have selected as you can see here we could add captions like testing captions just like that and you could add some links to your page and you could add some links to your post just like that you could add media over here you could add from computer upload from library or you could design with canva for example we're going to go with this random picture i found in google over here on the facebook options you could choose what album it is going to be saved and like publish a first comment with your post just like that and you could say amazing just like that and as you can see here this is our preview of our social media and you could add cues and profile over here you could add more caption actually you could add emoji you could put in location uh, add hashtag list over here you could location targeting and language targeting over here now after editing your post over here you can simply publish now or you could choose the date and time you would like this specific post to be published you could choose any of this date over here for example i would like it to be uploaded tomorrow april 28 and i could add this to the date just like that april 28 apply just like that and click on apply and now this will be uploaded on the april of 28 at 10 p.m 10 p.m or 10 a.m now you can simply click on schedule or publish now and you would be able to publish this specific post on your facebook page now over here on the social media inbox this is where you will be able to see your reviews assigned and all over here like incoming items as you can see we have nothing right now we could connect our a facebook ad account over here also we have no more items right now you could also create an inbox assistant tool over here profile post in this section you could check out listening over here right now there is no listening we're going to check out our listening you could also check out your calendar over here as you can see right now this is our post we have our testing post over here that we have added earlier as you can see this is our roi you could check you could see your report statistics like reach engaged users organic reach paid reach clicks other clicks over here and your roi statistics would appear here also you can also check out your funds and followings in this section over here right now we have none because our facebook page is newly created you can also check out your statistics over here like your roi like your fans engagement impressions brand awareness and many more art information over here like audience growth as you can see engagement unavailable user activity unavailable because we haven't done much on our page this is a completely new page and you could download your reports over here or schedule reports over here you could also check out your content section over here your global and performance community management and competitors over here over here this is your social media roi you're going to have to connect your google account your google ads account over here your google analytics and you would be able to see your roi for your facebook page and just like what i showed you earlier you could add publish post over here you could click this and you could do the same thing that we did earlier you could publish something on your facebook page and that's basically it guys that's the basics of how to use agora as you can see it's very easy to use it's very straightforward there's no complicated things that you would need to think about you just need to post check the reviews check the statistics and all of those stuff now you could access more things when you subscribe to more plans of course and over here we will be able to check out the different plans available for us we have standard which is 49 dollars per month we have professional which is 79 dollars per month we have advanced which is 120 dollars per month you could also have a custom over here if you would like to have custom and as you can see here these are the different features that would be available depending on what type of plan you are trying to access 
and that's it guys hope you enjoyed the video thanks for watching